Hello and welcome to Sunday in the Studio. Today I'm briefly going to talk about what you can expect if you book in um, a family photo shoot with me and that goes for maternity, newborn, sitter, cake smash, that kind of thing. Um, what will happen. The only exception here, I'm not really talking about mini sessions because they run slightly differently. So um, primarily I'm talking about my key, uh, my core packages really. So anytime that anyone gets in contact with me uh, and wants to go ahead and book or at least wants to explore their options, then we'll have a telephone or in-person consultation if you'd like. Uh, we can also these days do it by Zoom, FaceTime, WhatsApp, this kind of thing, WhatsApp call. And I want you to be able to get to know me because especially for those with the newborn photo shoots, I want you to make sure that you're entirely comfortable handing over your brand new baby to a complete stranger. I don't want to feel like a stranger to you. I want you to feel like you know me. And hopefully these videos will help somewhat with that. But I want to talk to you in person and reassure you and make sure that we're a good fit for each other because we might not be. And I want to make sure that everything feels OK for you before you hand over the most precious thing in your life. Um, ideally, in an ideal world, I'll have got the mum in for a maternity session beforehand because I am on a mission to help women to celebrate family life and to capture those precious moments of what her body is going through, even if it doesn't necessarily feel amazing at the time, still capturing those memories because you'll want to look back one day when your kids are gone and flown the nest, you need to make sure that you've got something to remember these moments by. And I see far too many mums saying, I don't have any photos of me when I was pregnant. And I'm like, what? <laughs> so ideally, I want to catch you at the maternity session because that gets you a good chance to get comfortable with me and see how the whole process works before you go into the newborn sessions, which are a bit more of an investment and they're more time. And obviously your newborn is very precious to you and I would treat them very much as my own. Um, so we'll have a consultation on the phone. I'll make sure that you're totally happy with everything. I'm always completely upfront about my prices. They're all on my website for you to see. I absolutely abhor the way photographers will lure people in with a free photo shoot or a really cheap photo shoot only for them to spring a surprise price list on you when you view photos and then you're almost tricked into buying them. Um, I hate that, at least with me. When you come to the photo shoot, you know that you're going to, you know exactly what the prices are and you know what you can come in planning to spend. And if you spend more than that because you love your photos, then that's great. But there's never any pressure from my aspect to do that. I hate pressure sales. Um, absolutely hate it. I've got had bad experiences with it myself. I'm not going to do it um, to you guys. So um, I want you to make sure that you understand everything that's going to go on talk about the admin that we have to do to book a session so we have to pay a deposit but that deposit is literally just to secure your slot and it goes towards the packages or products that you want to buy afterwards so you're not paying me as a photographer for my time the only thing that you're paying for is the products or packages that you want to buy at the end of it so that 100 pounds just guarantees your slot um and you know what if you come and you view your photographs and you hate them then we both walk our separate ways, you get your money back and we haven't lost anything apart from an hour or a couple of hours of your life, which sounds very dramatic. But this hasn't happened yet, so please don't worry. I'd just like to reinforce the fact that there's no risk really because if you don't like your photos, then I'm more than happy to give you your money back because I would hate to spend money on photographs that I really don't like. Um, it kind of defeats the whole object, so... That's the kind of before the booking thing. If you're happy to go ahead and book, we don't have to do, we don't do it over the phone. Um, we can do it over the phone if you want, but um, we just go through the admin and I'll send you over all the details and emails so you can think about it, check with anyone you need to check with, and then we'll book it in. So you come along for your session. That's the easy part. I'll do other videos about that. And then when you're at your session, we'll decide a rough time for you to come back and view your photographs. Normally about two weeks after your session, um, depending how busy we are, I, I aim for about two weeks because I don't want you to get like, well, I, w I want the feeling still to be there, the excitement about your photos. So I try and do it as fast as possible for you. And there's always the option of a sneak peek uh, on the evening of your photo shoot as well. Um, but you do need to give me permission to use your photos. So people don't always get that because if they don't want other people to see their photos, then I can't do that sneak peek. So when you come back for your viewing, 
you'll come back right here to the studio and that goes for the studio photo shoots and also the outdoor photo shoots as well. Um, this is again where I said the mini sessions might differ because I potentially do an online gallery for that, but there, that's neither here nor here, there at the moment. And you'll come here and you bring anyone you want to to the session that will help you pick your photos. Um, and what I'll do is I'll show you a slideshow of all your photos and hopefully I'll be handing you the tissues as you start to cry because you love them so much, um, as happens on most occasions. So you watch your photographs and then after that, it's a case of deciding what you want to do. And I've got various packages for each of my services, um, ranging from five photos to all of your photos. And you can either take them all and get credit towards gorgeous wall art like these ones um, or you can just go for a, a basic package of five digitals for example um, and like I said there's no pressure to do it but what I've got is some brilliant tools that will help you visualize this just how amazing these photographs are going to look in your um, in your home so if you send me a photograph of your room and where you might put these photographs on your walls, I can show you to scale what size photographs can look best on your walls. So I can tell you right for that space, 24 by 24 square vintage frame will look amazing. Um, and it's, it's just a tool that wows people because it's, it, people, I always find clients are scared to go big with their wall art. Um, they think that the eight by 10 prints that you get given are more than enough. But when you see that and how just how small that is on your wall, you think, oh yeah, that does look a bit silly. And especially if you've got a family photograph where you've got four or five faces on there, those faces look minute. So it's always worth having that in mind. So I'll, I'll make it really easy for you to send the photos over to me. We'll work out the scale of it. It's super simple. And you can see just how it'll look in your house, in your space. Um, and it just takes away the worry that you might get it wrong. And um, yeah, you'll be able to make sure that when you leave here, you know that you've got something that you're absolutely going to love. It's going to work perfectly in your home um, forevermore. So yeah, that's uh, so that's kind of the, consulta the consultation and the view and order session you come back for. Um, you'll make your order at the view and order session. That's the purpose of the session. Um, I'm there to help you decide. I'm not here to press you, but if there's certain factors that you have to have to consider, like the size of your home, the sort sort of the the spaces that you've got, then I can help you advise on that. Um, and and I've got a good idea of the sort of um pieces of wall art that will suit your decor or suit your style of home, sort your era of home. Um, and just, yeah, help you help you make that decision because you don't want to get it wrong. It's a big investment um, and you and you want to make sure it's right. So that's the point of the view and order session is to view, uh, view your photographs and make a subsequent order. And then we'll go ahead and you will get your um, your packages or your wall art um, in the next two to six or eight weeks because all the, all the wall art pieces are custom made they're amazing quality they're they they can take a little while some of them some of them come quite fast uh but depends which provider i'm using but i always like to err on the side of caution that yes you might be waiting for a while but this is a piece of art for your home like what's more unique than having a piece of art that has your own family in it um it, it's amazing so uh there might be a little wait for your wall art but generally your digitals and prints will come back really quite quick um and then after that i'll just be inviting you back for your next session whenever you fancy it and um, i'm always happy to hear from you guys if you ever want to come for a a cup of tea or whatever in the studio then i'd be more than happy to welcome you and um yeah if you've got any questions feel free to comment below and i'll um i'll do my best to answer them take care guys